Hello, Internet friends. This is Tim Schrock from Design Build Solutions bringing you today's Tech Tip Tuesday. We've got an interesting situation here where a very thick basement wall has a, an opening in it that is not the same size as our um, window unit itself. Um, I've kind of touched on this previously with basement windows, but uh, this is somewhat unique, so I thought I'd share this with you today. Uh, this is what it currently looks like in the model. Here, let's pull it up. So Chief puts, <clears throat> excuse me, Chief puts the um, through window there, through the both uh, layers of of wall. Um, I've got a, a exterior foundation wall and then an interior wall there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open this window up. And we're going to go into, oh, I just had it and I've forgotten it now. There we go, casing, double wall options. We're going to make this not through. And so it's going to disappear in that second layer of wall. I'm going to do a shift F6 so we can watch it kind of happen. Now I'm going to take this and I'm going to copy and paste it in this layer. And I'm going to take the casing off. I'm going to make this just a little bit wider. Let's go 32 and let's go taller. Let's go like 59 and keep the sill at 39. And let's call this a pass through because it's not an actual window. Once again, this is in the casing, it's not through the double wall option, so that's good. And I'm gonna open that up just a little bit more. Let's go 63, 39. And um, I'm actually gonna take frame. No frame, as frame, take that off because I want that drywall return. And so that's how I would do this, um, model up this version here. Looks like wall thickness is made be a little off, but uh, that's not the point of this, this uh, exercise right now. Other than a wooden sill that's right here, um, I think that's looking pretty close. I hope this has been helpful. Um, if you learned something uh, here today, I would appreciate a thumbs up. Um, always appreciate that encouragement. If you um, have thoughts and ideas or questions for Tech Tip Tuesday um, for upcoming weeks, uh, do let me know that as well. And we'll try to get that into the... Uh, into the schedule here. Otherwise, this is Tim Schrock from Design Build Solutions saying, have a great week. Thanks for watching.